Hi Natalie, welcome to Snap Math. Thank you for sending in your question tonight. So we're trying to prove by using the intermediate value theorem that there is a zero or a root to this equation on the interval from 1 to 2. So what we want to do is we want to plug in F1 and F2 into this equation. So what we get is 1 to the fourth uh, plus 1 minus 3, which that's going to equal negative 1. And then if we plug in this, 2 to the fourth, to the fourth plus 2 minus 3 is going to equal 16 plus 2 minus 3 so that's 18 minus 3 is 15. So F2 equals 15 and F1 equals um, negative 1. So what we do know is from the interme intermediate value theorem that there is going to be a point that crosses the x-axis in between these two points. So basically what it's saying is if the outcome of one point to another point is one's negative and one's positive, then there is going to be a root on that interval. All right? So that's basically all you need to do is just show that one's negative and one's positive and then state that the intermediate value theorem will... Um, indicate, we use that theorem to indicate that there's going to be a zero. So f of 1 is less than, sorry, is less than 0, and f of 2 is greater than 0. So that means somewhere in between those two points, at 1 and 2, there will lie a 0 or a root. All right? Thank you for sending in your question tonight, and we look forward to answering more of your questions in the future. Have a good night.